happy, happy birthdays to Luciana Gisela's and Kaylin Stark. Hope you girls have a great birthday. Hey, teachers, if you want to be on this week's school news, email me some more. We are looking for news podcasters. If you are interested in hosting the news, working with technology, and getting creative with the green screen, let Mr. Nair know. Thanksgiving Middle School House Challenge. Make a TikTok or Instagram post with the theme of a thank you card. She missed some more to share and earn those points. It will only be on the news if you want it to be. Entry house challenge for Thanksgiving. Write a thank you note to someone at this school. Bring to Miss Samar, who will give you house points and deliver it. Students, if you want to be on the school news, contact Miss Samar. Where in the world is Casper? Yesterday he was in front of a statue that celebrated this city's independence from Spain. Today he's in front of the building that houses the constitution that was written. This city has a population of 19.2 million people. It is the biggest city in the Western Hemisphere and the second city in the world after Tokyo. It's time for our second annual Thanksgiving Pie Challenge. In order to be invited to the Media Center Pie Party, you will need to read a persuasive article, an information article, and both of those articles will be found in the Media Center. And then for entertainment, read a book and take a reading counts test or give a book talk. Once those three items are completed, you'll be invited to the Pie Party at the end of the month. For today's This Day in History, on November 5th, 1994, George Foreman, at the age of 45, becomes boxing's oldest heavyweight champion when he defeats 26-year-old Michael Moore in the 10th round. Hey, fourth graders, I miss seeing your faces in the media center, and I know you're working so hard. So, Miss Ellie and I have a plan for you. In the mornings on the patio, see Miss Gordon or the fourth grade teacher who is supervising and they have six passes to the media center in the morning. And then when you take the pass, you come to the media center and you can check out books and take reading counts tests. And right now, it is, if you pass reading counts test, you get a prize right away. Or if you, if it's not a reading counts test, you can make a Flipgrid video and you can earn a prize that way. So, in the mornings on the patio, look for Miss Gordon or the teacher who is supervising fourth grade. Ask him for the pass to the media center. Miss Ellie will be there to help you and give you prizes for all the books and reading counts tests and Flipgrid videos that you are making. And check out this Flipgrid video by Anthony because he read a book and did a book talk on it. Enjoy! <laughs> Today I'm going to talk about the monster show. It tells you everything you didn't know about monsters, like some don't bite, some, sometimes um, monsters dream, and like, they really do look silly in underpants. And like, they go on. Roller skates, scooters. I bet you haven't saw them ride on an airplane. <laughs> Don't jump on their belly or they're going to get back. Hmm. It's more safer jumping on the bed. Yeah, what else does it talk about? Hmm. It talks about a ball. If they eat a whole car or filled with peanuts, they're probably gonna not gonna get full. You need a plenty of more food than that. Beyond more. So many food to fill, fill it. Make a monster full. So that's it today.